Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to secure Facebook account. So if you're interested, let's start our tutorial. So first thing that we want to do here is we first want to go to our Facebook account. So open up Facebook here. Now from here, we want to go to the tree bar icon or the tree dash icon that you see at the top right, just underneath the messenger icon. Now in here, we want to click on our settings, which is located at the top right of your screen. In here, we'll see different information about our account. So we have the personal account information, password and security, and a lot more here. So the first thing that we want to do is we first want to go to password and security. And here by default, the first thing that you'll see is the check your port and security settings. So you just want to click on that. From here, it's going to give you options on fixing the security checkup or the security of your account. So this is actually pretty important. So it's going to give you a few things for you to secure your account. So one of those is turning on the login alert. So whenever you turn this on, every time you log in, uh, in your account, it's going to give you notifications that you just recently log in. So this might be really helpful. Like for example, you don't know who logged in your account and you get a notification about that login, then you will have the chance to basically save your account in case of a hacker going into your account. Now in here, it's going to give you also information about your password, if it's okay, or if it's strong enough to support your account. We also have two-factor authentication, which enables us to further secure our account by using another device or SMS to basically try logging in into your account. So if the hacker doesn't know your phone number or doesn't have access to your other device, then they won't be able to log in, therefore securing your account. So right now, you can just go ahead and just click on fix now and go through the whole process. But if you want to do things manually, you could go ahead with the other settings here. So in here, you'll see the uh, where I'm currently logged in. We have the phone, we have the PC here, as well as the uh, login. As well, you have the option to change your password and the two-factor authentication again. So we also have the authorized login and a lot more here. So you could just go ahead and go to settings here and tinker with all of the settings or security that you can change here. So if you want to add to factor authentication, just click on that and you have the option to either use a authentication app or a text message or a security key that you need to enter whenever you log in. And that's it. So the other way or a few things that you should remember when you're securing your account is you want to, want to make sure that the information that you have in your account is not publicly disclosed. Meaning some of the information that you have online is not available to everyone. So let's go to personal, personal account information. Now in here, we want to go to contact info in here and basically change the visibility of some of your information. So instead of making everything public, you might want to set like, for example, your email address only viewable to your friends or your phone number or even other information would be limited to your friends only so that not everyone could actually see your email address and phone number. But yeah, just need to basically make sure that you're not disclosing very important information about yourself and avoid uh, your, avoid having your identity stolen by other people. And that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.